Because in the year 2000, the luxury car industry had two car manufacturers, Maruti and Honda with market shares of 25% and 75% respectively. So basically in 2000, out of all the cars sold in the market, 25% belong to Maruti and 75% belong to Honda. I mean, that was the market share. In 2001, the overall market for the product is increased by 50%. Overall market for the product. What product? The luxury cars. You getting it? So in 2001, what happened? It increased by 50%. Which means in 2000, if 100 luxury cars were being sold, in 2001, it reached 150. Right? So overall, the market size increased by 50% and a new BMW also entered the market. A new BMW also entered the market and captured 15% of the market share. So a new uh, manufacturer came in and it captured 15% of the market share. If we know that the market share of Maruti increased to 50% in the second year. Second year meaning 2001. The share of Honda in that year was how much? 50, 45, 40, 35 or none of this. Now though it looks like a complex one, a lengthy question. Let me tell you it should not take... Uh, more than five seconds to arrive at the answer. We are not worried about what happened in 2000. I mean, if you really look at it, it, it says in 2001, the overall market for the product increased by 50%. Fine. BMW entered the market, captured 15% of the market share. So in 2001, if you see, there were three manufacturers, right? BMW. How much is the market share? 15%. It captured 15%, right? Maruti is the second one. It says, we know that the market share of Maruti increased 250%. This word 2 is very important. Increased 250%. Remember, in the previous year it was 25%. In the next year it increased 250%. So Maruti is 50%. How much is Honda is the question. What do you have to do? Total market is always 100% only, right? I mean, total market is always 100%. Out of that 100%, BMW has got 15% share. Maruti has got 50% share. So how much should Honda be? Honda will be 100 minus 15 minus 50 which is equal to 35. Option 4 would be the answer.